Hello guys, welcome to Filament Daily. Yesterday on this channel we had a video about this big form. If you haven't watched that video, I will link that in the description below. So today I want to quickly show you how to transform that big form with sections into tabs instead. Because on our filament examples we implemented both large form with sections and also with tabs that looks much more compact vertically if you prefer. So instead of long form. So there's a form with, as you can see, form method and sections for all the fields. And all we need to do to replace that with tabs is, well, replace section make everywhere with tabs tab make like this. We replace all and now we have tabs. And then we need to wrap those tabs. So there's tab make, tab make, and we need to wrap that into, well, tabs. The whole schema of the form then becomes tabs make. We don't need any title. We also provide column span full and then provide the schema of those tabs. And then inside of the array, we paste those tabs. So I scroll back down to the end of the form and I will end the form with ending that array paste here, comma, reformat by PHP storm. And now let's refresh. We refresh that page, see section, section, and another section. We refresh and we have the same information, the same inputs, the same fields. I didn't change any of the values of the fields, but those are divided into tabs. This is, of course, just the surface level in the documentation of filament. You can read more about tabs the overview and what are the potential customizations. So you can add icons, positions and stuff like that. What do you think we can discuss? What do you prefer, tabs or sections? It reminds of an eternal discussion of tabs versus spaces, now tabs versus sections. What do you think is a better user experience for users? That's it for this time and see you guys in other videos.